Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about percent of change. We're going to find each percent change in its percent and state if it's an increase or a decrease. So if I was given this problem from 326 feet to 241 feet. So 326 feet to 241 feet. Well, hmm, what should I do with that? Well, is that an increase or decrease first? And well, 326 goes down to 241, so it's a decrease. So we have a decrease here, okay? Well, what should I do with that now? So I need to find the difference first between these two numbers, 326 minus 241. All right, so let's use this traditional method here. 6 minus 1 is a 5. 2 minus 4, oh, can't do that. Let's make the 3 into a 2, uh, 2 into a 12. So we have... 12 minus uh, 4 here. 12 minus 4 comes out to be good old 8. And 2 minus 2 is just 0. So we have 85. I take the 85 and divide it by 326. Okay? So 85 divided by 326. I'm going to use my calculator here. Uh, I don't need to, but it makes it easier. 85 divided by 326, which isn't the basis, just because it's easier of doing it, but I'm doing it here for speed reasons. 0. 2607. Okay, so we have approximately def decimal of 0 0.2607. I now need to write that as a percent. So I take that decimal here and move it over two units to the right, one, two. So we're left with a 26.07%. But now that needs to be rounded. That zero, right? The zero here. That causes the 6 to stay a 6, right? That's what's rounding down, essentially. So we just have a 26% decrease as our final answer. So let's recap. We started from uh, 3, not 4, 326 feet to 241 feet. I can look a little nicer, but generally when I do that, it doesn't make it look nicer. So 241 feet. That is a decrease, so I wrote it there. Uh, it's going down, so I found the difference between the two. 326 minus 241 came out to be an 85. I took the 85 and divided by 326 to get approximately a decimal of 0 0.2607. That converts into a percent by taking the decimal and move to the right two units. 26.076, uh, 26.07 percent is our percent change, but it needs to round to the nearest percent. That zero causes the six here to say it, uh, stay a six. So we're left to the final percent of a 26 percent decrease.